if you ask me does intermittent fasting work once you drop weight a lot of health issues are going to go away so it's basically like what most people do on a on a daily basis don't now fast for 16 hours and then start eating burgers start eating pizza start eating meat spice you have an eight hour window does not mean that you should eat everything you need to eat like eat like 10 different food 10 different meals within that eight hour window hi welcome back to another video so as you can really tell from the title we're going to be talking about intermittent fasting whether it's a myth or the truth yes so i'm going to try as much as possible not to make this video so long yeah so we can just quickly talk about it and get on with our day if it's your first time here see my beautiful face hi welcome to my channel my name is ogo mbike and please subscribe to my <laughs> Please subscribe right now because you will enjoy being here. You will love it here so much. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back and let's get right into the video. Let's talk about what fasting is. Fasting is when you restrict your body of any kind of sugar source from food, from drinks, from anything for a period of time. Now, intermittent fasting involves fasting for a certain period of time and then having an eating window where you eat and then your fast continues again there are different types of intermittent fasting out there now it depends on you and the one you want to choose do i swear on intermittent fasting yes okay let me break it down for you now there are different types of inter intermittent fasting we have the 16 8 intermittent fasting we have the 18 6 intermittent fasting there is the 24 hours intermittent fasting there is the 36 hours intermittent fasting there is the three days intermittent that different types of intermittent fasting the one i've done i have done the 18 6 intermittent fasting that's the one i'm very conversant with i've also done the 16 8 intermittent fasting that's also good and fine if you're a starter i will, I will recommend you try the 16 8 intermittent fasting intermittent fasting has been proven to help so many people with their health conditions help so many people drop weight and once you drop weight a lot of health issues are going to go away i have done intermittent fasting for the most part of my life when i'm trying to lose weight i go on it if i'm trying to lose weight fast i do that i am currently doing intermittent fasting till date i started again last year till date i use an app called zero so this is not an ad it's a very good app that helps me track my fasting period so that i know when i start my fast and i know when i'm breaking going into the app there's some other features it has but like I said, this is an ad. So all it does for me is to track my fasting time and tell me when I need to eat and when I need to start my fast again. So yes, I have done the 18-6 intermittent fasting before. I have done the 16-8 intermittent fasting before. All it all in all this means, what this means is that you're going to fast for 16 hours and then you have an eight-hour window where you can eat. For example, you had your dinner, your last dinner by 8 o'clock, 8 p.m. tonight. So 16 hours later, you're going to eat by 12 noon tomorrow morning. So it's basically like what most people do on a, on a daily basis. People that eat um, their first meal of the day around 12 noon-ish. So they're basically they're having, um, living an intermittent lifestyle, but they're not even aware of it. So you eat your last meal by 8 p.m. You don't eat anything again except maybe herbal teas and um any other tea that has nothing to do with sugar honey or any sweetener so you you fast for that period of 16 hours from 8 um p.m till 12 noon the next day you are literally sleeping for the first um let's say 10 hours it, it's it's for the eight hours you're sleeping let's say you have eight hours of sleep so that cancels that you've already had eight hours of sleep then when you wake up in the morning most people don't eat as early as eight o'clock nine o'clock ten o'clock so most people start eating from 10 11 12 actually so it's quite easy to do a 16 8 um intermittent fasting and when you break it you're supposed to break it with the fruit normal intermittent fasting or the accurate way to intermittent fasting is to break with a fruit and then you have your first meal of the day and then you have another meal but as you're fasting when you're about to break whatever you're eating within your window of eating your whatever you're going to 
consume within your eating window should also be healthy if you're trying to maintain a good health and lose weight you don't because you fasted for 16 hours and then you're breaking it and you're eating junk food the whole idea is that you're not going to be tracking your calories when you're doing intermittent fasting but even if you're not tracking your calories you eat like a human being you eat healthy as well eat good food eat wholesome meals don't now fast for 16 hours and then start eating burgers start eating pizza start eating meat pies start eating um fufu you can eat fufu Fufu is not so bad but then it's in smaller quantities if you're going to consume those high calorie meals eat in smaller quantities but i would advise you should eat pizza and um and burgers and fries and all that stuff because the whole point of doing intermittent fasting is to lose weight and be healthy right so if you're doing all that why then are you going to go back and then spoil what you've already started so yeah that's where the problem lies when you now fast for a 16 hours and then you have an eight hour window does not mean that you should eat everything you need to eat like eat like 10 different food 10 <laughs> different meals within that eight hour window you have to eat still eat like a human being eat healthy it's good quantity of meal we're not tracking calories at this point so whatever you're eating still eat it in good quantity and good quality meals that's it that's all this is about intermittent fasting nothing there's no big deal about it it's for you choosing the one the one that works for you if it is the 18 six hours that you feel works for you it works faster when you want to lose weight you will lose weight very quickly if you're following that and you're also fasting it's called the fast and you're sorry and you're also doing cardio or you're also exercising something called a uh, fasting cardio you will the weight is going to drop on the scale this quickly yes so intermittent fasting is really good i am currently doing the 18 6 intermittent fasting some days i go back to the 16 i do the 16 8 depending on how i'm feeling emotionally or depending on how I don't know just depending on how i'm feeling it depends but most times i'm on the 18 6 like today it's already um i think it's already 2 3 p.m right now i haven't eaten i had my last meal yesterday by 7 p.m and i haven't eaten so that's i've gone um let's see i've done so this is uh, 18 hours already i'm counting so once I'm done recording, I'm going to have my first meal and I'm going to break my fast with an apple before I have my first meal for the day. And then my fasting again is going to start by six or seven ish. That's it. Literally, it doesn't take so much. So imagine that you're doing intermittent fasting and you're exercising, maybe going for a walk as little as a walk, 30 minutes, one hour walk. And then you're mind minding what you're eating as well. You're going to lose weight very very quickly and fasting also help with insulin who's having insulin issues blood sugar issues it will help if you're having any health issues fasting has been proven to help with that yes so intermittent fasting is it a myth is it um um it, is it a myth is it the truth i would say it is the truth based on my own personal experience it's been okay it's been wonderful for me now if we're going to talk about intermittent fasting with people that have health issues like ulcer i would say i don't advise you to do a long intermittent fasting if you have ulcer i advise you to stick to the 16 18 intermittent fast if you really want to do that stick to the 16 8 don't exceed that treat your ulcer ulcer is treatable you can treat your ulcer but in the process of doing that you can manage and do 16 8 intermittent fasting if you really want to do intermittent fasting so yes it's okay it's fine you're not going to die nothing's going to happen to you have your um antacid at hand if you have any ulcer um ulcer's care take your antacid or go and eat if it gets terrible like if you have ulcer pain please go and eat if you can manage it manage the 16 8 intermittent fasting fantastic you can do it and to help you lose weight very very quickly and very fast so yeah that's it on intermittent fasting in a layman's term breaking it down for you that's all intermittent fasting is eating at particular having a particular window where you eat and also having a particular window where you fast you don't consume anything besides water tea without any form of sugar or sweetener yeah that's all about intermittent fasting guys i hope i made sense and you learned one or two things from this video thank you so much 
for watching. If you watch the end of this, to the, <laughs> if you watch this video to this point, you are so sweet. And thank you so much for always clicking back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. Click the subscribe button right now. Turn on your post notification to know when next I post another video. And give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, guys. I can't wait to go and eat my food. I'm so hungry right now. <laughs> but I know once I eat this apple, it's going to hold me for a little bit. I'm going to drink some water. I had some tea earlier this morning. And I'm going to have my lunch in the next 30 minutes. So it hold me while I prepare my lunch and have that in the next 30 minutes. So yes, intermittent fasting is fantastic. You should give it a trial and thank me later. Bye guys. And I will see you in my next one. Love you. <laughs>